Uh, so first and foremost, um, we want to assure uh, the public um, that uh, the hospital, uh, we have strived to maintain normal operations uh, and critical functions. Uh, there may have been uh, uh, some delays uh, here and there uh, because of uh, the ongoing uh, start action, uh, but all critical services, um, we've tried to find a way, continuously plan to make sure that those critical services are running. Yeah, so no uh, Kenyan who requires uh, uh, critical services will be turned away. Uh, and I wish to give that uh, assurance. I also wish to uh, appeal to the unions, the three unions, uh, to come uh, to the table uh, and work with us to ensure that we find an amicable solution uh, to this and to restore industrial harmony at the hospital. Uh, we've just had a long session with the union uh, representatives and uh, we've made that uh, uh, request again uh, to them to suspend this uh, action. Uh, but I wish to inform uh, the public that uh, we've also uh, uh, taken court action uh, this afternoon uh, asking the industrial court uh, for an injunction against this uh, uh, strike uh, to allow for time uh, for conciliation and further negotiation on this matter. Uh, this matter has gone on for a long time, since 2012, so uh, we've gone to court for an injunction uh, to allow uh, the management, the union, uh, time, uh, as well as uh, we've received communication from SRC that they are going to come to the hospital uh, to undertake a job evaluation uh, within the next uh, three weeks. So we await for that action uh, by SRC, and then out of that, uh, we'll sit down uh, together the uh, the government agencies and be able to find uh, a way forward uh, on this uh, on this issue.